Ladies and gentlemen, is it time because the, the UFOs and aliens are actually trending over on Twitter. In fact, like in entire globe right now, everybody's talking about it. And, and the situation is kind of getting wild. A lot of people are sharing like video footage as well. It, it is very hard to say what's real, what's not. If you're new here, guys, this is the type of content we do. We do horror videos, UFO content. If you're new, definitely subscribe. Apparently, this is claimed that this is that video of the UFO that they shot down. And I'm seeing that for the first time as well footage of the ufo shot down over alaska february 10 2023 and this is the object here and there's like bunch of clips that i'm gonna show you so that's a damn that go pow son god damn bro so they shot down the ufo as well and we're not sure what exactly is that and now the reports are coming out that there in february 4th right chinese spy balloon shot down that was clearly a chinese spy balloons we we saw that right. Right? they showed us footage and we saw the the wreckage as well february 10 this happened just yesterday ufo over alaska got uh, got shot down it was the size of a small car now today just uh, uh today in canada i'm in montreal let me know where you at montreal canada that's where i'm at ufo canada shot down today and we have the video from trudeau through the queue uh, we're gonna actually play that video as well in a bit right. February 11th. So this happened just a couple of moments uh, ago. Like, like it's happening as we speak. UFO Monta Montana. The jets were scrambled. So this is really oh, shit. getting oh, shit. out of hands. I gotta show you a bunch of clips there. Okay, check it's this kind out. Of unusual that these pilots saw different things and that is sort of i guess adding to the mystery of all this yeah not even the pilots apparently were really able to identify what they saw and just to take you back for a sec on thursday the uh the u.s defense officials sent f-35 fighter jets up to try to figure out what this object was that was flying around near alaska those pilots we have learned have given very conflicting accounts of what they actually experienced with some pilots right. saying that the, the object interfered with the plane sensors other pilots saying that they didn't really experience that Yo, that that's uh, something that we heard many many times if you have been in the loops if you're not definitely subscribe we covered content like that bob lazar actually said similar things and there were a bunch of other people that even i believe uh, commander david uh he done a massive podcast a big podcast with joe rogan a while ago and he said that during his time back in 2004 he did encounter those of you know what i'm talking about you know what i'm talking about those of you that don't uh just for those people drop it in the comments uh back in 2004 david uh commander he's a pilot used to be a pilot and he he was intercepting a ufo that just disappeared and, and it shot up and got to the place where they were supposed to go so the ufo knew where they would be in the future and it got there within blink of an eye so the speed was just uh, I, you cannot compute the speed apparently and he gave his testimony gave his experience and uh, and uh, yeah and a lot of people that have encountered stuff uh, obviously you, if you want to believe them you you can believe them if you don't want to believe them you can choose to not believe but the the situation here is that a lot of these uh, so-called experts would come out and would say that yeah whenever we got close uh, our stuff would malfunction and stuff like that so it, it, we heard this a lot right i guess it's now time time to show us maybe can you show us stuff other pilots saying that when they looked at the object they could identify no identifiable uh, identifiable propulsion system and they did not know how it was actually staying in the air cruising at that altitude Dang. of about forty thousand feet so this is all added to the pentagon's wariness of describing in more detail what this object actually is until and then check this out Ooh, Econ. Recovery operations are now underway and will be supported by the Canadian Armed Forces in conjunction with the RCMP. This coordinated operation will allow a further investigation into this object. We have no further details about the object at this time other than it appears to be a small that is bull squash that is uh, they have everything they know about it otherwise they wouldn't have shot it down I, they i mean they know what it was all cylindrical object and smaller than the one that was downed off the coast of north carolina i also spoke today du territoire uh, ladies and gentlemen they also ended up shooting down a ufo in romania check this video out or click the video on the left because this arab ghost hunter he almost dies and he captures this check these videos out guys they don't want you seeing this and i'll see you right